I'm on a customer's car right now, but I really don't care. Um, I got out of another customer's car and they had Howard Stern on the radio. Now, I've never really listened to Howard Stern all that much and I really don't care about him, don't care to know about him. But um, they were talking about the Kiss Cruise and how you have to be vaccinated to get on the Kiss Cruise, which, okay, I don't agree with, but okay, if you want to do that on your private cruise line, whatever. Like I said, I don't agree with it, that's fine. But the rhetoric that was being spewed to me was just vile. Um, Gene Simmons had literally said something to the degree of, and you can double check this, but if you're vaccinated, if you're not vaccinated, then you have no right to infect other people regardless of your rights, which are delusional, and that you are the enemy. And Howard Stern had essentially agreed with him. I'm paraphrasing, but that's pretty close to what it was. Leaving aside the fact of vex vaccine efficacy or any of that, just think about that. Um, I don't think you're the enemy if you're not vaccinated or if you are vaccinated. This doesn't have to be a dogmatic thing. This doesn't have to be an all or nothing approach. This doesn't have to be so zealous and, you know, full of vitriol and it's sad that it's became this way I, I it shouldn't have to be like this um, if you want people to get vaccinated make the case educate people um, explain to them why you think they should and if they think they should then they will but if they don't then they should have the right to not get vaccinated because as we see if you get it you can still spread it and regardless of that, just calling people the enemy over a medical decision, I, I, there's something very sad about that, that we've come to this point. I hope we can all turn it around and I hope that people kind of ramp down the tensions over being vaccinated or unvaccinated. I don't know where it goes from here, but it, that's just terrible. It's not good.